Welcome back to the law, random reviews. I want to take a look at Noah's Animal Rescue, the board game. It's a co-op game, ages four and up, two to four players. So simple game, kind of like a better take on maybe Candyland. It is co-op. So what you're gonna do is got the board set up here. You have a flood token. It's gonna start at the end of this flood uh, counter right here. There's five animals to choose from. I chose the, the wolf, the chick, and the hippo down here. You put them on the number spaces. Take a deck of cards, shuffle them up. Gonna deal three cards each player. Everybody's three cards, we're in a draw pile. So on your turn, you're trying to get all these animals to the Ark before the Flood Token reaches the Great Flood. So it's co-op, so you don't really have to hide your hand. Uh, but what you do want to do is try to get them as far as you can. So say I'm going to take uh, the wolf. So the furthest thing for him would be the mushroom. So the mushroom is all the way here. So we'll take him. He'll just skip all this stuff. We'll go straight to the mushroom. And then I would play that into the discard pile. Second player we go. So they have a raindrop. <clears throat> if you have a raindrop in your hand, you have to play it on your turn immediately. And that pushes the token towards the Great Flood. So that's pretty much the whole basis of the game. Uh, the co-op kind of part of it is, so say, this person has another mushroom, and then you, you draw at the end of your turn. Yeah, at the end of your turn, sorry. You do draw a card. But like I said, the co-op kind of aspect of this thing is, let's get another mushroom card out. So say the second player has a mushroom card. If they play it, they don't occupy the same space. They push this guy to the next one. So you can help push the other animals into where they need to go. So on your turn, so you go play that. You kind of try to do that. You try to get as far as you can, and then maybe the second person tries to push the other person in before all these raindrops come out. So I think there's maybe one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13 raindrops in the deck. There's two, so there's at least 13, I don't know if there's more. Uh, but being random, uh, it does, can happen that reach the great flood before you get all your animals in there to change difficulty you just add more animals into like how many you want to get into the arc so it's an easy game plays fast the board is nice and colorful uh a little co-op aspect about pushing your friend further is nice and you do have a, a little bit of a um, sense of danger with the flood coming so it makes it a little more fun versus just rolling and moving to the end which i think candidly end is right whoever gets their first wins so this is everyone plays together to beat the flood and like i said it can happen since it's random you shuffle the cards you don't know if these flood tokens just come out one after another and just keep pushing this thing forward and you're like down here so not bad for this that is noah's animal rescue so of course aim towards you know, family, younger audience. But for what it was, I think it was fun enough. Thanks for watching Triple R. Have a good day or night, wherever you are. Smash that like button, hit subscribe. I do appreciate it. Thanks.